Well, hey friends, I went to Walmart today and I picked up some things. I initially went to get some produce and popcorn and a whole bunch of other things jumped in my cart. So I want to share with you what I picked up today. I got two bags of white cheddar popcorn. They were two for five dollars. And then I got these Garden Earth Blue Corn Chips. So I'm almost 99% positive that these are on Trim Healthy Mama. Um, I'm going to double check before I eat them, but I'm almost positive that these blue corn tortilla chips are on plan. And then I got some pretzels for the kiddos, garlic powder and parsley, some mustard, um, baking soda, Truvia. They were completely out of the loose, the cans of tr uh, Truvia, so I just had to get the, these are packets. I seem to go through these a little bit more quickly um, than just the loose the can, but you gotta get what you gotta get. My husband is away for the weekend, um, so and I'm not gonna have a vehicle, so I needed to get these things now because he's gone really for the next like four or five days. Um, these uh, grape tomatoes, I just bought a huge container of them from the grocery store. However, these were a dollar twenty-three. And who knows what I'll do with them. Um, I may make like salsa or something. But I love these things and can eat them like candy. White mushrooms. A English cucumber. Romaine lettuce. Uh, popcorn. Mommy, mommy. Okay, go finish. Okay. <laughs> um, popcorn. And um, baby dill pickles. This big box here, um, this is a glass storage set. It's 16 pieces, so basically it's like eight glass dishes with eight matching lids, and this is the set there. Back over here, did I mention bananas? I don't remember. If not, we got bananas. Um, and then I needed a water bottle that I could tote around with me when I'm out and about, so I got this Contigo water bottle. If you've been a... Um, following my channel for any length of time, um, or at least I guess I should say from the beginning, I did a video where I talked about um, my love for this Contigo water bottle. It wasn't a whole video dedicated to it, but it was in part of one. Um, anyways, what I love the most about this is this fits in my truck cup holders, and I like that when I'm driving, I simply have to push a button and the um, spout comes up, and what I have now is a Nalgene bottle, and the Nalgene bottle you have to unscrew and never fails. I always dump it on myself. <laughs> always. Every single time that I'm in my vehicle, I dump it on myself. This I can continue to keep one hand on the wheel, um, take a drink, and boom, you're good to go. Plus, this is like, this turquoise blue color oh, is life to me. It is like my favorite. Okay, so Pepto-Bismol, the Equate brand, which is a Walmart brand. Um, this is vitamin C, so this is for my Trim Healthy Mama uh, Singing Canary drink. Um, I talked about this, and sorry for my little chitlin in the background. <laughs> um, I talked about this in my grocery haul. I bought lemons for this drink. It helps heal your adrenal glands, and um, the optional thing to add is vitamin C. So the thing with vitamin C, and it took me a long time to find this particular brand, is that it is often loaded with additives. So things like maladrextin or something, like all these name things that I cannot pronounce. And this particular bottle, um, oh, it's not going to focus well. Sorry, guys, I don't have a very good camera. Um, it's free of artificial colors, preservatives, or sweeteners. No dairy, starch, sugar, wheat, gluten, yeast, soy, corn, eggs, fish, shellfish, salt, tree nuts, or GMOs. So um, I will just grind up a couple of these capsules because they recommend 2,000 milligrams of vitamin C in this drink, I think. Maybe it's only 1,000. I'll have to look at the recipe. But anyways, I'll just grind this up into a powder and add it into my drink. But I was really happy to find this. Um because there were so many that had junk in them. So then I got some Trident gum. This is one of my favorites. We needed computer paper, and then some wipes, and just trying to uh, get ready for cold and flu season. 
Thankfully we haven't had any yet, but I did get some cough drops. I don't know if I said this, but um, we got some Tums and then this shampoo for Aubrey. Funny enough, Herbal Essence, I was finding this at the drugstore for like 5 and $6. And I'm like, this is an inexpensive shampoo. Why are you like 6 bucks? So they had it at Walmart for about $2. So I got her a bottle of that. And then this is some Christmas decor stuff. Sorry, my little one is just all over the place tonight. Okay, so this is some Christmas stuff that I picked up. Um, it was only 75% off. I thought it would be more, but it's not. Um, but I picked up a couple gift card holders, and I love penguins, so these are so stinking cute. So I got three of those. And then I got this pack of gift card holders. Oh, they're so cute. Um, and then I got these bows. I once picked up a bag of bows this size at a yard sale, and they were red and green and white and so perfect and Christmas fun, um, and we have went through them in the past three years. So I got two of these bags, they were I think like $1.25 or something, um, and I love the colors, so I got those, and then... I got this Maybelline Colossal Big Shot Mascara in brownish black. I try and actually get my mascaras in um, brown colors. So I've never used this. We'll see how this goes. 8 out of 10 people um, saw root to tip volume instantly. So we'll see how that goes. And then I got a new brow product. So we'll see how this goes as well. I've never used this before. However, I would say for the past four years maybe, I have used a Rimmel quad of eyeshadow, um, this one particular color, it's a dark brown color, and it actually looks, it actually looks like this color right here, um, and I've used that for my brows, just eyeshadow, no anything else, just eyeshadow and I have completely run out like I hit pan and then I've used it all completely um, and so I've needed to find a new brow product the thing was is that this color was absolutely perfect now this is a wax and a powder I've never used wax on my brows so we'll see how that goes but I haven't been very satisfied with the way my brows are looking using the powders that I have available to me right now so I've been on the hunt the past few days um, trying to just find strictly a brow powder but everything seems to come with a wax that's at the drugstore and I'm a drugstore girl so um, the last Christmassy thing that I got was this um, kissing ball and it's got like the faux boxwood and glitter and white berries and it's so fun and so very me so um, I was excited about that I picked up a few things they're already in the, um, the fridge and freezer so I'll show you those too so I got a bag of peas and I guess that was it for the freezer stuff and then in the fridge I picked up some Johnsonville um, brats, some pork chops, and then uh, boneless, skinless chicken breast. And a big thing of cracker barrel cheese, marble. Okay, so here is my Costco haul, and there are a couple things in here that are not from Costco, and I will let you know as soon as we get to them. Um, so first of all, we got a big bag of clementines and then these Kirkland brand um, makeup removing wipes. I really like these. They come in several different smaller packs inside of this box and there's a couple that are really small packs like maybe 15 wipes or so and they would be perfect for traveling. I haven't gone anywhere to use them for traveling but um, it is just a smaller size kind of convenient for that or maybe even putting in your purse for whatever. Um, so this was not part of the Costco haul. This is a Cricut self-adhesive mat um, or ad adhesive cutting mat. You stick your vinyl or your paper or fabric or whatever materials you are using with your Cricut die cutting machine on this and load it into your Cricut. So I had some projects that I want to do and for the life of me I cannot find my mat anywhere. So my husband picked this up for me at Michael's. 
And then we got some cream for coffee, can't be without that, um, a pound of butter, and two packs of sour cream. They come in a two-pack milk. And then this is um, cauliflower. It's frozen. Um, I was looking for this in the summer. Could not find it. Our Costco just carried um, broccoli and cauliflower mix. And then, so one of the last times we were there, we actually saw the frozen cauliflower and uh, by itself, and I was so excited. So that's our first pack of that. Um, Nutri-grain bars. My kids will be so excited to see those. A pack of the Kirkland brand frozen chicken. A two pack of eggs. Um, three Greek yogurts. And then honey bunches of oats. We always seem to get that. My kids and my husband love that cereal. A two pack of bacon. Some marble cheese. Hamburger. I'm hoping to do a kitchen day sometime this week, and I want to do some meatloaf and meatballs to put in the freezer. So we wanted to get that. Some bananas, uh, toilet paper, and then this was pretty exciting. Um, my husband got these pillows. So this is the Nova Foam Comfort Gel Infused Memory Foam Pillows. And we both <laughs> are really excited about these. Um, he came in with one pillow, and I was, he's like, I bought myself a new pillow. And I was like, that's great. I'm so jealous. And then he went out to get more stuff and brought me in mine. So I was pretty excited about that. It'll be fun to sleep with these tonight. So there were those. So we also got two bags of dog food. So one is the Kirkland brand dog food, and then the other is a Purina Pro Performance bag. And he's already, my husband's already taken that into the laundry room to get the dogs fed. And then, this is not Costco. This is something I picked up, well, my hubby picked it up for me. But I found it on Kijiji tonight. Kijiji is like Craigslist. Um, where people list things to buy and sell and I happened to go on the furniture section today and I saw this piece and I knew it would be perfect for our bedroom. Our bedroom's really really tiny. We don't have a closet. Um, we just use an armoire from Ikea and I figured that this would be great storage for, we just have like a little bitty bookshelf in our room for books and to hold like um, some beauty supplies and different things like that. Um, Anyways, so I thought this would probably do really well with that, holding all that stuff, and it would give us a ton more storage. I'm really, really excited. So anyways, that was a fun purchase, and that will be fun to get into place and organize tomorrow. That's it for my haul. Little random, lots of stuff that we needed and maybe I didn't need. Pizza. Oh, good job. I made that pizza. I can I'll be. I'll be we had... Um, Tortilla, tortillas, like tortillas, uh, with, <sighs> sorry. Oh, good job. Okay, hold on one second. Are you all done eating? Okay, put it on the counter. Good boy. Okay, can you guys be quiet for one second? Well, thank you so much for watching this haul. It was a little bit random, a little bit fun. I'm excited to use this stuff and to take down the rest of my winter decor and put something else up. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.